In this video, I'm going to demonstrate the price change manager by CSI Works. And the scenario that I'm going to use is that um, on certain days and at a certain time, we want the price of our items, uh, certain items, or maybe the entire menu of all of our items uh, to the price we want to go up. Or maybe we want the price to go down. In any case, the difference being is that we're not using discounts or fees. We literally are changing unit price of whatever is being put in the register. Um, and so let me quickly demonstrate the setup aspect of this. We have a price change and manager app. And so I have this one to be triggered always. Uh, so let me go ahead and delete this one. So this is the one that's working. And let me actually do this backwards a little bit. Let me show you how it's working first. So we're going to go to our fish, which is $9.99 per pound, right? Uh, so we're going to go one, let's do one pound. So one pound, and I'm going to hit add, and the price goes in as $10.99 a pound, right? Uh, you got that. And so there it is, uh, the price went up. And now let me show you how it's done. And the word test B is put in there to kind of indicate the price change because right, there has to be a reason why the price has changed. So now let me show you how this thing is set up. Um, I said, okay, here. So I have a name, that's what shows up as a trigger. Right, so we have a start date, uh, 520, that's today. Um, it starts, uh, it goes in as an all day event. We have zero, zero at the start time and we have 24 hours at the duration. We have recurring checked. We recur every one week, every day, no end. And so this is basically a way to express always, right? And I'm doing always just so that we can catch that particular moment. But, you know, even if I get rid of these days because today is Friday, right? Or is it? Thursday. Yeah, today is Thursday. So definitely not Monday. So even if I keep it this way, right? So let me see if we think it's Thursday. Yes. So we can get rid of all these and just keep Thursday and no end. And it'll still trigger today. Um, I'm choosing my items without category. So I have this one selected and I have fish. Okay. Um, so these are the items save all right let's just go back to register i'm going to save this one and try again i'm going to go to all items fish well the current price is 9.99 so i'm going to do you know one pound the price goes in as 10.99 so it's perfect um now i'm going to go and edit so let's say that it starts so my time is 9 a.m. Let's say that it starts at 8 a.m. Uh, there it is. Um, okay, 8 a.m. and it goes for 24 hours. But now you're gonna get a message that says 24 hours is not possible after 8 a.m. and we're just gonna cut off at a certain point, which is perfectly fine. Items are selected, hit save. There it is. So. Now we're still going to trigger because we are after 8 a.m. It's 9 a.m. I'm going to go into all items and I'm going to grab my fish and one pound and the price changed to 10.99. All right. So now I'm going to switch this. I want to catch eventually the situation where it's not triggering because the schedule is different, right? So let's say that the start is going to be 9. 11 uh, like this all right so again i'm saving everything saving and then i just want to oh it's already 9 11 so i suppose we need to change it to 9 12 now i want to show a scenario why it may not work um, so zero nine zero nine twelve okay yeah 
next save. All right, so now we have it in one minute until it starts. So right now the discount will not trigger. I mean, not the discount, but the price change. But if I talk for a minute and it switches to 912, uh, let me show you that it is 912 on the unit there. Uh, so it's 911 still on the unit, but once it switches, so there it is, it's at 912. So I'm going to delete this item and I'm going to add fish again. And now the price is going to change. Um, so certainly triggers, just, you know, find out, um, just look at how I have it set up and see if you see anything on your way uh, when troubleshooting why it's not triggering. Hope this helps.